Okay, welcome to Linux Music. This week we're going to do Calf Monosynth. It's an LV2 plug-in. I, I love these LV2 plug-ins. I don't know why. They're just visually appealing. Uh, monosynth is uh, uh, everything you learned last week or the last couple weeks on AM Synth. Everything you know is, is also here, plus a few more things cool, some new, cool new waves and some filters. I think you're going to like it. So let's get started. Okay, so here we go. This is uh, Calf Monosynth. Uh, hopefully, some of this stuff looks familiar to you. Uh, the thing that I, the only thing I don't like about this is it's a monosynth instead of a polysynth, which means if you play a note. You really only get a note at a time uh, instead of a full chord. Uh, but there's, there's lots to love about this thing. Uh, notice that the cutoff uh, for the low LFO is in hertz here, down here. Uh, there are tons of waves. Uh, look at, there's lots of different filters here, including some high pass filters, uh, notch filters, band pass filters, all kinds of things you can play with uh, with, with respect to filters. Uh, we'll see in a minute. It's got a lot of waves. Uh, so here is, is, hopefully this looks familiar to you. You have an oscillator, another oscillator. Here is the mix between them. Uh, as we saw before, here's how you can transpose. Remember to the, to the uh, we did, I think it was seven, and did a perfect fifth last time. And that's that. Uh, here's the, to detune them slightly like we did with the saws last time. Uh, over here, uh, you'll see... Uh, more LFOs with respect to uh, the envelopes, and here here's the envelopes. Uh, here you can send this LFO to the cutoff filter on the front, uh, to the pitch or to the oscillator, like we saw last time. So a lot of this should look should look familiar to you. Uh, so just to start as an experiment, we'll uh, look at the. I think we ended last time with the two square waves that were slightly detuned and the, the filter that was wide open, so we have that now. Okay, so uh, that part, uh, just like any synth, you can set up a pair of square waves or pulse waves, uh, slightly detune them, uh, open, that, open that cutoff filter up wide and uh, get that tone. Oh, I feel like Keith Emerson, except he knows how to play the keyboard. Uh, uh, that would be a, a subtle difference, uh, or one of many, maybe. Uh, anyway, uh, there's there's lots to like here. Uh, a variety of waves. The ones saw two square pulse sine triangle. You hopefully you're familiar with. Here's a very step. Let me uh, move that over so you can hear that wave by itself. Okay, a skewed saw. Let's try that. Okay, still works. Uh, yeah, I still got it. Uh, smooth brass. Put this back over. So there's there's lots of waves here to play with. Let's uh, put it back to something a little more familiar. Okay, shut that down a bit. And try some different filters. Oh, this one, this one's kind of cool. What it is is, it's two. Note: if you have both waves going, you know I should have there. Yeah, if you have two waves going, you can uh, have each of them cut by by twelve and watch this. I love 
love it. Uh, well, let's just do a band pass. Where it's, look, it's rolling off the frequencies that, that aren't part of the, of the thing. Uh, two by six. I can split the two apart. Uh, let's go back to that. Watch them split apart. And it's rolling off each of these two different waves individually. Uh, that's kind of a cool feature. So th this thing is, uh, like I said, every synth manufacturer has a different idea of what, what should go into it. This is a very nice one. Uh, lots to play with here, lots to experiment. Uh, as we showed you with the uh, original thing, this... this uh, let me put that back. Yeah. Uh, the stuff we all learned before still translates over here. There's just a little bit more to play with. Uh, hopefully, this is a, a nice step into a more complicated uh, synth and while still retaining some familiarity. So that's it. Uh, have a blast. Calf Monosynth. Uh, it's a LV2 plug-in. It'll work in your various uh, digital audio workstations or standalone like this. You can you can play with it any way you want. <laughs>